Forge might be the most cherished legend that we never got in Apex. And Apex are back at it again, teasing Forge, paying more tributes to him, because next week we get more story progress in Season 20, with a cinematic that takes place in the exact same spot where Forge was killed by Revenant. As we see a Revenant clone being interviewed by the same Lisa Stone who witnessed the death of Forge. But then Revenant comes in, in the exact same way as he did before, and kills his clone, just as if it was Forge himself. It's just a bit of a funny cinematic, but they're once again throwing hints at Forge that they've actually done many times in the past, and Revenant's heirloom even has an animation where he pulls out Forge's medal. And a lot of fans have always said they'd like to see Forge make a grand return in the form of a simulacrum, and he did even have leaked abilities that we've since seen in the game. During the Final Fantasy event, we got the Buster Sword, which was a special mythic weapon that allowed you to slam the ground and cause damage to anyone caught in its blast. This was one of the leaked forge abilities where he did have a ground slam that would damage and stun enemies below. The Buster Sword also granted users a dash, and Forge had a similar bull rush where he could dash into enemies and then uppercut them just like with the Buster Sword. So we already got a taste of what it would feel like to actually play Forge, and now Apex are just giving us even more teasers. Do you think one day we will actually get Forge? It seems like they're really holding on to this one, and all of us Apex fans have held on to the memory of Forge too. So it's something I could see them doing one day.